Hi guys, this is Cressy with the July update for the Eternal Wall of Art Supreme. So we have big news. The competition to name the road that will lead to the Eternal Wall is coming to a close. This, ladies and gentlemen, is your last chance. The competition will end on the 9th of July. So if you haven't submitted a story of hope, please do. And if you can't think of one, maybe you can tag a friend that might have one themselves. This is a super exciting opportunity, guys. The name itself will stand for hundreds of years. And we can only imagine the amount of people that will be impacted by the chosen story. Now, here's a quick reminder of the rules in case you had forgotten. The name can be something generic. So you could go ahead and name it Hope Road or Faith Road, but you can also name it after somebody that you know that has an inspirational story of hope. Here is a legal fact for you. You cannot name the road after somebody who is still alive. With that being said, here is some of our team to give a few suggestions on what they might name the road themselves. So I have two suggestions for road names. I love Remembrance Road because I love the fact that we're remembering the things that God has done for us. And I also love Wilberforce Way because I love the fact that he was a man of prayer and the prayers that he prayed and the way that he lived that out impacted the nation that we live in now. So I would name the road Olive Way because it will be after my husband's uh, nanny or granny and uh, she passed away a while ago and I've been hearing so many amazing stories about how she invited people into her home and she'd feed them, she'd teach refugees how to knit and I just really think that is a really powerful example of, of a community and I think this is what Eternal Wall is, we're building community, we're, it's built by the community, by the church and because of that I think, you know, she represents that really well. So my suggestion for the road is Mosley Avenue. There was a wonderful woman called Maria Mosley who supported Eternal Wall right from the early days before I even joined but she just so generously into the project even though she didn't have much, I think it was a real widow's mite situation and she was personally generous to me as well. We had a wonderful drive together to Harrogate where I just learned all about her life. She was amazing and unfortunately last year she passed away from breast cancer so I feel like just commemorating her her name and what she did for Turner Wall would, would be really special. So that's why I'm suggesting Mosley Avenue. I think that the name of the road should be called Journey Road because not only is every prayer significant but it's got a journey that's been involved inside of that. So. So I was thinking about the name Victory Drive or Victory Road because I just thought all these answer prayers are about Jesus triumphing over different situations so that idea of victory. <coughs> my suggestion for the road is Monument Way, it's called after my father um, because his name is Monument and um, he's always been in involved in the work of God, planting churches, he's planted over 200 churches with the team that he worked with, the Assemblies of God, and now I thought it would be a great <laughs> excuse for me to do things my way and say, we're doing it the monument way. Wow. Name for the road? Yeah. Road you make road face? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> wow, look, there's some crazy suggestions there. I'm not quite sure about roadie, roadie face, but King Quest Expressway, now that sounds good to me. Guys, this is your very last chance to get your entries in to name the road to Eternal Wall. Get racking your brains. Do you know someone, maybe a grandparent or maybe a friend that you've known in the past that's maybe opened an orphanage or raised someone from the dead? Get your amazing stories in. This is your chance to be a part of making hope visible. So if you want a more detailed version of the rules, you can watch this video by Rich explaining everything. It's in the top left corner. Also, if you want to enter the competition, all you have to do is click the link in the description. So what else have we been up to? We've been running our online webinars and they've been great fun. You will also have an opportunity to watch the next one. So tune in, you will get some behind the scenes and some exclusive info about Eternal Wall. So you don't want to miss the next one. We also had an amazing opportunity to do another one of our land visits and praise God, the weather was a lot better this time round. So that is all from me for the July update. Don't forget to enter your names and suggestions for the competition to name the road to Eternal Wall. And also don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we will see you next time. Take care, stay blessed, peace.